The current phase of the voter registration drive was kicked off today during a luncheon at the Dearborn Street Community Center. Political candidates, social workers, voter registration workers, and interested citizens attended today's meeting to hear John Lewis, Executive Director of Voter Education Project in Atlanta. He stressed the importance of each citizen getting their neighbor registered and not waiting on celebrities to start a big campaign. This is a, it was a very crucial year. If we don't get people, our people registered and turn people out to vote, this may be the last opportunity that we will have in many, many years. Lewis says 15 million blacks are eligible in the United States, but only half are registered, with half of those registered in 11 southern states. Out of the estimated 400,000 total population of Mobile County, less than half are registered, with 30% of those estimated to be black. How long have you been registered? Oh, about mm, 14, 15 years or longer. How long have you been registered? Oh, about five years or more. Did you have any trouble getting registered? Sure didn't. Well, I don't know. I haven't been down to sign, you know, sign up for all this. You know. But, but uh, next voting time, I will, though, you know. The black voter registration drive is not limited to Mobile County alone here along the Gulf Coast. Mrs. Coretta King, the wife of the late Dr. Martin Luther King Jr., will be in Pensacola tomorrow to help push their voter registration drive. John Keffer, Channel 10 Newsbeat.